So Brad, what does the first six months look like for your coaches as they come into their territory, as they bought the territory, what does the first six months look like? You know, your first six months is like anything that you start brand new. Any business that you're going to start brand new, you've got to work your tail off for the first six, 12 months. Um, you know, we're opening a restaurant just down the road here and my partners who run the restaurant, they'll be working 12, 14 hour days to get it started. And I think that's one of the things that uh, when you look at a business, it's like a train getting it off the, off the, out of the station. You got to work your tail off and you got to make up in numbers what you lack in skill. Uh, and lack in experience type thing. So I think that's really important. But also it's a lot of, if you look at the emotional side of it, there'll be a lot of doubting yourself in the first six months and thinking, am I doing the right thing? Am I not doing it? I go back to when I first started coaching, okay? Uh, the systems that our, our franchise partners have today are phenomenal. The systems I had back then uh, didn't exist. You know, I, my literally, my first coaching session with a new person was, well, what are the 20 things you know you should be doing and you're not? And then the first 20 weeks of coaching was, let's do one of those per week for the first 20 weeks. Like it, it, and, and it doesn't need to be more complex than that. You know, a lot of people try and overcomplicate what coaching is. Um, coaching really is about taking action. It's no more than that. It's about getting them to do the things that need to be done. A business owner, unfortunately, has uh, a lack of confidence on doing new things, taking a step out. And that's where, as a coach, a lot of the time, half of our job is just being a cheerleader, just holding their hand and saying, yes, that's a great idea, go do it. They've had the idea, they've known the idea, they've known what to do, they just didn't have the confidence to execute. And having you on their team gives them the confidence to execute. Um, a lot of that first six months is about building reputation, getting known in the marketplace. You know, there's three layers of marketing when we look at the launch of a business, right? There's instantaneous marketing, so the short-term stuff that will generate leads immediately. Then there's the mid-term stuff, which is more, so the short-term is very direct marketing focused, from telemarketing, getting out and networking. Well, networking is more in the mid-term type stuff, but doing the interviews, the avalanche program, doing those things in that first period of just straight direct. And you know, statistics tell us very clearly, 8% of people, when you connect with them, are ready to buy immediately. That means 92% of people you connect with in the first six months have to be nurtured. Not, not just the first six months, forever. 92% will not be ready to buy immediately. They need nurturing. And part of that nurturing is having them read your eBooks or, or our eBooks, having them attend webinars that you present, okay, on the eBooks or on any of the, the PowerPoint subjects that you do. Because what happens is you've got to build that nurture. And Google tells us very clearly with its Zmot study, Zero Moment of Truth, that it's 7 11 4. Okay, so seven hours you need. And this is why our program to bring on new customers is 13 steps. Okay, and, and it's interesting. We've been doing that for 17 years, I guess, that actual 13 step process. And only last year did Google come out and prove we were correct. It's seven hours of research, 11 touch points, a text message, an email, or whatever. We're 13 touch points. Um, and then four of, in four different locations. And that's why in our 13 steps, you have coffee with them. Okay, that's one location. You go to their business, that's one location. They come to you, that's a third location. That You meet online, that's a fourth location. So we've been doing that without knowing the research, but now Google's given us the research type thing. So the nurture of watch a video, and, and if you look at our YouTube channel, uh, where I've created, I think it's five videos, where someone can watch the five videos that fully explains what is coaching, how does it work, what's it cost. Everything they want to know about coaching is on those five videos. Plus, then there's 28 most asked questions about working with a coach. Plus, then there's the six steps webinar. So there's seven videos that any prospect that wants detail can watch and learn everything. Most prospects today, if you connect with them, they'll be about 20% along the buying journey. If they reach out to you, they'll be about 80% along the buying journey. 
Now, if they've done the research, and research shows you want them to have seen 30 pages approximately of your website, right? That's why our website has a lot of content, a lot of blogs, a lot of videos, podcasts, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. Um, you doing a newsletter or an email a day to your prospects is not out of line anymore. There's, uh, what do we got? Five podcasts. So literally every week, there's five Action Coach podcasts. There's the BizX, there's Brad Sugars, there's the Action Coach, the Franchise Coach. Like all of these things that you can every single week be just sending one a day to every prospect that you've got, plus your own content. And you've got a nurture sequence that allows you to build that relationship. So your immediate marketing is that direct marketing. Your midterm is more the digital marketing, okay? So doing the building your social media presence, building your database, all of those sorts of things. And your long term is your relationship style marketing. And if you start with all relationship style marketing, networking and strategic partners, then you know it's going to be a long term marketing strategy. Don't expect immediate results from long term strategies, okay? If you want immediate, you got to do immediate. And uh, that's, you know, again, that's how you're training of the 20 something strategies. That's why you've got to pick out of that what suits you best. But you better have at least one immediate strategy in your marketing plan. And that's what you're going to do for the first six months. Plus, there's a ton of watching videos. But that's not during the day. Do not watch videos during the day unless you're on your lunch break. Have lunch with me every day. You've got 90 days of lunch with me in your first six months. You all recognize that, right? So you're having lunch with me every day for the first 90 days at 30x biz. 30, it'll start with life, then do biz, then do wealth. I know some of you got a head start on that in your pre-training. But yeah, you and me are having lunch together for at least 90 days, and then you got podcasts, so there's already 60 of those. So we got another 60 days of you and me having lunch together. And by the time you get through all of that, I'll probably have done another 20 podcasts. So uh, then you'll have another 20 days of lunch. But yeah, your first year is basically you and me having lunch. That's basically your first year.